Hey guys, it's Amber and welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, hi, hello, welcome. Today we are back with my favorite household. Yes, we are back in the legacy household after what I think has been like a six or seven month break, but don't, don't hold me to that. Um, but we are back with Amber and Rashad and it is first thing in the morning and Rashad has actually just got promoted to department head. So Rashad has been promoted to department head. He will now make an additional $12 per hour for a grand total of $56 per hour. He's also received the following bonus. So he got 595 simoleons and uh, he actually basically has to go to work in an hour. The pop-up was down there a second ago to uh, say that he could work from home, but I missed it. So I guess he's going to have to go into work today, but he's doing pretty good. So I'm just going to have him pop up and get some leftovers before he heads in to work this morning. Amber also has to go to work. Um, she's got a couple hours before she needs to go to work, but I'll have her go ahead and get up as well, just so she can take care of her needs. In the last part, sweet little August did age up. And so he is resting away. He's doing pretty good. He is hungry, of course, because, um, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, my toddlers are always hungry. So this is no different, no different than any other time. So August is sleeping away over there. Um, so we're gonna get Amber up, have her take care of her needs. And then probably before she heads into work, we'll have her go ahead and get some food for August as well. I need to get leftovers. Oops, sorry. I forgot how to play this game. I don't have like toddlers and stuff in any of my other saves, so it's kind of hard for me to remember what I'm supposed to do. So we'll put some food out and let's get this little guy up, have him come grab a serving before it gives me notification that my toddler's very hungry. If I don't feed him, he'll be taken away. And we're just gonna go check on him. Oh wow, look at all these whims she has towards Rashad. Be friendly with Rashad. Cloud gaze with Rashad. How cute. I hope she's not going to get in his way. I think she's going to try to give him some juice, which is cute, but we're, we're going to get him some food, food, baby girl. What are you doing? Uh, eh, 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 hey. <laughs> Go to work. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? It's cute. It's cute. I love that you're like here for your son, my guy. But like, let's let's get let's get that check. Okay, go you you go to work. Thank you, buddy. August is like, I got this. I'm taking care of myself. Gonna get my own food. Strong, independent toddler. I don't need anything from any of you guys. So Amber has work in 10 minutes, so we will probably just send August to daycare. Let me have her come and brush her teeth before she heads to work. Okay. Let's, we'll join Amber at work just because um, we sent Rashad to work, so it's really not a lot going on. I probably won't show a ton of her day today just because I feel like the career stuff can get a little bit. One or more creative sins have been removed. Mm, okay. Like I was saying, I probably won't show a ton of her day today because I feel like these can sometimes get a little bit monotonous. I enjoy the playable careers in this game, but I know it's not necessarily the most fun thing to watch. We do have a child here, and I don't know if I mentioned, but I kind of like the idea, not that you can focus in The Sims, but I kind of like the idea of Amber being like a pediatrician, so primarily focused on, oh, 
that did not look good. That that didn't look good. I don't I don't think that should have happened. I was gonna say I'm no doctor, but that's it's not true. It's not true actually. <laughs> oh, she's feeling really bad. Amber likes to sit and observe their surroundings before getting comfortable. Oh, and dripping blood. Okay, so she's actually on her menstrual cycle. Okay, I don't know. Okay, so she does have... She does have some products that she can use. So we're going to take a break from seeing our patient and... Run to the restroom. It looks like someone was gross and didn't flush it first. So we'll let her flush the toilet and then... We will go ahead and have her use a tampon just so she can kind of take care of that. I'm hoping. Okay, so that gets rid of the dripping and blood moodlet. So that's good. She is still kind of uncomfortable just from there being so many people around. But she's going to have to get over that. I. She doesn't. She didn't choose a job where she could work from home, so... This is what she gets. So we'll come back to take care of our patient now that she's gotten herself together. She is having a pretty not good day. Maybe we'll let her kind of have a little bit of self-care tonight when she goes home. Or maybe we'll go to the spa. You know what? I haven't been. Amber, you have got to just stop sitting there. <laughs> Girl. Go do some work. Maybe we'll actually have a little bit of a spa day today after work. Rashad can take care of August and Amber and Laia can go and have a little bit of a spa day. It looks like we only have one option for diagnosis, so we should be good to go on that. So let's go ahead and treat this little patient. And hopefully she will feel all better. I would like for this day to go well because I would love to see Amber get promoted. I'm trying to actually finish both of their careers and she's only on level four. I think Rashad's actually already to level five, so he is ahead of her. So we need to try to catch up with that if we can. So we'll try to have as good a day at work today as we can. Girl, are you, are you just broken? What's wrong with you? I'm gonna, okay, let's reset you and see if that helps you. Cause you are, there we go. There we go. I know I haven't played in the save in forever and clearly it is not having it with me because <laughs> literally my sim is broken, but it's fine. It's fine. She's cute. That's half of, that's half of what matters, right? Her skin is definitely not it's finest right now so i think the spa might be a good shout she did have a baby i guess semi recently it's kind of hard to say in the sims just because like time is difficult but she could certainly be having a hormonal breakout oh and she is on her menstrual cycle so definitely probably having a little bit of a hormonal breakout Oh y'all now she's embarrassed by questionable exam results. Confused by medical data, Amber may need a second opinion on how not to be a bad doctor. I've never seen that before. I hate that she's having such a bad day today. I guess she's feeling rusty, kind of like me. It doesn't look like she can transfer cases anymore. I think she's too high to do that. And honestly, she's given up on this guy, so if anyone was wondering if she's a good doctor, the answer is no. Will she stop seeing you in the midst of your struggles to have a pre-made microwave meal? Yeah. Yeah, it seems like she might. <laughs> okay, so she did do a fantastic job today. She made 510 simoleons. Promotions in community health are surely in the future. If you say so, I'm not 100% sure that that's accurate for her, though. Okay, so she is home. She is looking... She's looking pretty miserable. She doesn't look very happy. So, what I think we're going to do... 
going to hop into manage worlds. Because I think I'm going to plop down a spa. I don't think there's a spa in this save. So I'm going to put down a spa. And I'm going to have her have a nice spa day. Because she's having a hard time. Okay, so I got the cute little spa placed. So I'm going to have her go ahead and travel. And we will, of course... Bring our bestie. And. Let's also bring Shari. So let's take Laia and Shari. And let's have a little bit of a spa day. So I added Cynthia's Nails in a Spa, I downloaded it from the gallery, so I think this should be cute. I think they can get their nails done, have a little bit of a fun time. I also honestly haven't oh. done a ton oh. with the whole Spa Day refresh. Oh, I was so, yes. really excited about it, but I just haven't really explored it very much. Ebony Dorfa. I no, think that could be fun. Steve, so this whole little spa is cute. It's got like a little bar. We can order food, a little bit of a couple of treadmills. We've got some yoga mats here. As well as some massage chairs. And then I believe, so Shari's actually literally ready to go. So she's already gone upstairs, gotten changed. So let's have Amber come up and let's just have her take a shower so she can go ahead and get changed into her robe as well. Let me make sure. It doesn't look like anything in here is like gendered or anything. So Rashad has unlocked the close knit lifestyle while we were gone and Foodies Unite has passed for a neighborhood action plan. I haven't really been paying a ton of attention, I don't think, to neighborhood action plans in this save, but I have at least a little bit. So we'll have Amber come and take a shower, and then we will, I think, go downstairs and get a pedicure. I don't know, we could get a full body massage, but I think a pedicure would be fun. I'm also, I think. <laughs> You were supposed to be able to get like face masks from that little those little fridges. I don't see any around. And I would love for her to also get Okay, I was literally gonna go get one of those little masks, but I actually see one right here. So let's have her come and get a facial mask. So let's have her purchase and apply a facial mask. And let's get a rejuvenating facial mask. Uh, uh, and then she's dealing with some cramps, but I'm gonna have her come down <laughs> and uh, request a manicure. Let's get one from Rua. That that mustache really tells me that he's he's on top of this. Look at that. That's the mustache of a man that can do some nails. And he's cleaning his chair. Yep, this is it. This is the way to go. So let's have her come down and request a manicure. Oh, she's feeling really relaxed. How peaceful and relaxing. She's en enjoying being alone. Okay, so her first impression is that she feels like this Sim is in dreamland. This Sim appears to be a little bit in their own bubble of imagination, a dreamland of sorts. And he's angry. He also does not appear to be doing my nails, so. Trangela shops him? Yeah. Maybe he's not the one. Let's try Rohan instead. Let's request a manicure from him. Because, um... He does not seem like he's having it. He doesn't like Shari either, so... 
Okay, he's very angry. Whip! You know what? No one at this spa seems to be, um... Very happy. Wow. <laughs> this is going so bad. Like, is she... These are the only two that she can get a manicure from. She's just like, nope, nope, that's enough of that. Don't want that. Okay. Um, so maybe no to the manicure. Let's try a massage instead. Since everyone down there is um, terrible. So let's come up here and see if we can request a... Uh, Let's get a lavender aromatherapy massage. Surely, um, someone in this spa has got to be okay with their job, right? She's uncomfortable, but she's not angry, so that's got to count for something at least. We have paid her, so I hope this means... Okay, here we go. Here we go. We can get a massage, you guys. I was getting a little bit worried. I was really um, giving up on the spa life because it clearly wasn't for me, but it looks like our massage at least is going to work. So I'm hoping this will help her relax at least a little bit. She is still feeling really... Not great about being out around a bunch of people, but hopefully a nice peaceful aromatherapy massage will make her feel a little bit better. So she is feeling focused from her aromatherapy massage. Okay, she wants to go take a nap on the couch, which is not really ideal. Um, I was going to see if there was anyone else that could do her manicure now. There is a different sim here. Charlie, but she's uh, looks like about to provide a service, maybe a pedicure to this guy. And I think she's the only one here now. So I wouldn't say this was the most successful spa day, but it wasn't terrible. She was able to get a massage at least. So I'm going to have her go ahead and head home because she's exhausted and I'm tired of her trying to go to sleep on random couches. I will say, you know, if I had to leave a review for that spa, I don't know that I could leave them a very good review. I just kept getting yelled at by the staff and I I just wasn't comfortable with that, you know? Oh! Laia well, is here. I wonder, she looks like she's maybe having some period cramps. I don't know. I wanted to see if I needed to give her menstrual supplies, but she looks like she's okay. I'm not gonna invite her in right now just because Amber's actually really tired and she's coming in going straight to bed. This little bean has um, leveled up in his imagination, but that's because he's making a mess. So let's have Rashad come over here and just do a little bit of parenting. Um, let's discipline recent behavior. We'll be calm. We'll ask him not to make a mess, please. S Sweet August, let's not make a mess. Look at him. He's like, what? What I do? Get a little bit of responsibility up for him. That's pretty. I mean, I feel like it's pretty hard to do. He's so young, but... We still want to try to give him at least some good lessons. And he's going to watch daddy taking care of his mess. So that'll help his thinking skill a little bit. Also, while I have Rashad here with him, I'm going to have him go and do a little bit of potty training. I think that August is was planning to go splash in the toilet. Oh, hello, friends. They're talking to me. We are having fun. Oh, he does not want to go potty. He does not want to do that, but 
He's going to have to learn. So we're going to do some pottying. There we go. He's a little angry about it, but not too bad. He's feeling more playful than anything. So I think that'll be fun. And then he's already getting a little bit sleepy. So we'll just have Rashad go ahead and tuck him in once he's done with the potty. We will read this cute little bean to sleep. Ooh, potty level two. Okay, he can now use the potty chair on his own. That's exciting. It just, it's hilarious how long it takes them to like potty. I just like, it's, I know that it takes children. It does actually take children a long time to potty, but it's like ridiculous. There we go. Let's read him to sleep. I actually need to be paying attention to Rashad's parenting skill because he has a, a family based aspiration. So he needs to help a child with homework three times. He needs a child to earn an A in high school. So we can't do that yet. He does need a child to max any skill. And I don't know if that counts for toddler skills. So maybe we will try to get one of August's skills maxed and see if that counts. Potty is, of course, what he's the closest to right now. So maybe we'll work on that. Amber just said she's very hungry, but like, I mean, maybe now, but like when you said that, like you're being a little dramatic queen. Look at Rashad being the first one up. Okay, let's have him come and take care of his needs real quick. And then he's got, he's only got like an hour before work. So we won't have him cook breakfast. I don't think he's gonna have time. So we'll let him get leftovers once he gets out of the shower. Amber's actually almost awake. We'll let her get leftovers as well, though, just because. Actually, you know what? Let's have Rashad work from home today. And we will have him actually. I'm going to have him serve breakfast. Amber's probably not going to get any because she's probably going to need to eat before. But I'll have him serve breakfast for him in August. We can have a little bit of a, a daddy Sunday today. While we send Amber off to work. She is focused. She needs to have some fun though. So we might have her come and watch a little bit of TV. TV while she's eating breakfast. Or she can stop eating breakfast and come watch a little TV. Whichever. That, I mean that works too. Whatever she likes. So we'll let her take care of that. And then Rashad will come in and cook. August actually isn't really that hungry. But he, he will be. I think by the time he wakes up. So we'll just have Rashad come and serve some breakfast for him. Little breakfast scramble. I'm pretty sure Rashad likes to cook. So yeah, he likes cooking. So he's having a good time. So he'll enjoy doing this for August. Oh, I think I missed them kissing. That's sweet. He was eating his breakfast scramble, but I don't. Don't know what he did. There it is. There it is. I was going to say, I don't know what he did with it now. <laughs> August is pretty well rested, but I'll let him sleep a little bit longer just because I don't want to wake him up. And I guess while he's sleeping this morning, we will have Rashad go and take care of some stuff for work. So he needs to, we'll send Amber alone. Rashad needs to tutor a tutor student online. So we'll have him take care of that while August is still sleeping. All right, so August is up and he's a little bit hungry. So I'm gonna have him come and grab a serving of this breakfast scramble that his dad made for him. And Rashad's almost done with tutoring this student. He does also need to conduct research, but we can't do that from home. So we'd have to go to a community lot, which we might, but we'll spend a little bit more time with August kind of at home working on some of his skills since Rashad really wants to have a child master some skills. We'll have them do a little bit of skill work today just to see if we can get that up for August. And then we'll also have Amber. Let's actually have her come and schmooze her boss so we can see if we can get a promotion today. 
And then Rashad finished with that. So we'll have him come and we're, we're not going to cook. Let's have him put away this food and do a little bit of cleaning up. Let's go ahead and teach him to talk. We'll work on communication because that's his lowest skill. I'm hoping he doesn't do it in the bathroom, but you know how Sims are. This room's like tiny. Oh, I'm so proud. Do you, do you guys see them not doing it in the bathroom? We'll do it right in front of the front door instead. That's logical. Boss a move, Enough. Aha. Whoa, Poma. We'll see if we can get him to at least communication level two. There we go. Communication level two. Oh, that's so cute. These two are adorable. Let's also have him. Let's have him play. August is telling him something. I don't know what. I still think this is a super cute interaction when it works. It is bugged out so much, but it's so cute when it works. Like, Okay, let's have Rashad do a little bit of work type stuff. So we will have him not practice acting, practice debate. And we'll let August play with some of his toys so he can come with what's that, hug and babble. And he's also getting his movement up while he's kind of moving around here, so. Okay, our power just got shut off because I've completely forgotten to pay our bills. And that's my fault. That's my bad. It's not even that we can't afford them. It's literally just that I just didn't. So let's have Amber come and pay the bills. Please and thank you. She did not get promoted today, even though we had her schmooze the boss. I just feel like she's so like stuck where she is. Okay, so... Bills are paid. Lights are turned back on. So we'll have Amber come in. Oh my gosh. Look at him go. <laughs> when toddlers get to the upper end of the movement skill, it is so funny to me. So let's have him come and talk about superheroes with his mommy. He's really excited for her to be home. Wants to talk to her. Um, look at him go. Look at him go. But also, Amber, why did you make your child come all the way out here? Let's um, pick him up and bring him inside. Camilla's also here, so we'll go ahead and in. ask her about her day. I just want to invite her in. But let's pick August up and bring him inside because I don't want him out in the rain. He'll get sick. So let's have him talk to mommy about trucks. Maybe say a little bit of nonsense. He's missed her. She's been gone all day. We'll say he's saying some nonsense about what him and daddy did today. And honestly, let's see if she'll read him a book. It's getting that communication skill up. So that's really good. And how long does he have? 
He's actually got three days till he ages up, so I definitely think we should be able to get some of his toddler skills maxed. I wish she would sit on the couch with him. Okay, she gave up. Stopped reading. Let's see if I get her to try to do it. Let's read a toddler book. Oh, yay, it works. This is cute. I love this. I don't see this interaction a lot. Not gonna lie, August looks a little bit concerned about this book. Oh, there's a nap instructor through the window. Like, I... I don't even remember what our neighborhood action plans are supposed to be. And I'm actually gonna take Rashad real quick to the library just so he can complete all of his tasks for work today. So I'm just gonna send him by himself and let him take care of that. So we can try to keep working on his career. It's like pretty late. Amber's like, yeah, just, you can run to the library and take care of that. Me and August will be fine. You just do some research. I'm glad I'm getting things done. Okay, he's really excited to be here doing some research. So I feel like Rashad's kind of like, you know, he's a professor, but he's also still doing, taking some classes, doing that kind of stuff. So he needs to do a little bit of research for class. So Amber's just going to handle August, take care of everything at home while he does this real quick. Okay, so he managed to take care of that. And we'll send him right back home just because... Just ran over to the library to do some research that he couldn't do at home. Okay, and with that, I think I'm gonna get all these guys ready for bed and get this part wrapped up. I hope you guys enjoyed being back in the Legacy household. You'll have to let me know what you think. I know it's been a very long time since we've been with these Sims. So I have to let me know if you missed them, if you still remember them. If you enjoyed this part, please make sure to like and subscribe. And I want to say thank you guys so, 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 so much for watching as always. And I will see you all next time. Bye.